All right, guys, so we are going to take a look into this a strike so take a look into the previous ranking as you can see i finished it already previously i was asked to make a video here so i am going to help you guys and guide you to success here and try to finish this um level 61 under the a strike now um if you guys like the channel consider subscribing and turn your notification on so as you can see in here the first weapon that i'm going to be using is i'm going to be using the laser and i believe the um the three missile thing is called torpedo so i'm just going to refer it to torpedo um so this three missile the torpedo basically i'm trying to use it as much as i can as well in the early um early stage in here but my goal in here right now is i need to remove the shield of the frigs so as you can see i am targeting the frigs and i am using the laser i'm not chasing them with the cannons um uh, you know the rapid fire cannon because with that it's uh, much more inaccurate onto the targeting system and in this one you know there is a time limit that you need to finish so uh pay attention on my targets as well i'm trying to target you know one of the frigates right away and eliminate them so don't try to hassle and um you know target multiple ones focus on one if you see one that is extremely low try to eliminate it fast as you can so that your targets decreases as the progress of this a strike level 61 now the level 61 is a little bit challenging i did do like 10 times to finish the first time i did it um you know it's it's part of the process you know you have to redo it you have to keep trying it and and you need to keep going at it so as you can see in here um, I'm using my laser. This is the way I am approaching the Imperial Frigates. Now, usually I'll be a little bit further, but um, now that I'm gotten in range, I switch to the cannon, and now I can eliminate, you know, further. Um, sometimes I miss, so it sucks. But right now, I really got lucky. Now, I'm, as I'm flying, here's a big tip: when you are flying, make sure that you are charging your um, laser. And at around 1.5 to 1.6 kilometers, you can actually hit the laser now so um one more advice that i want to give you guys is that um once you eliminate some of the frigates if you get close to the destroyer eliminate the destroyer right away now the reason why you want to eliminate the destroyer right away is because the destroyer actually hits hard and eliminates your frigs now the frigs that you have the friendlies that you have those ones that are helping you the color green ones they are very important in a vital you know aspect of this level 61 for them to survive for when you are going to hit the cannons that are in the defense of the uh, the structure later that we're going to fly into so i absorb a little bit of a damage then i flew out so as you can see pay attention to distance when i took some damage there i can't hold, keep on taking that damage i flew out now i'm going to be destroying the um, destroyers uh, by the way the cannon has about range of 1.1 kilometers at the max so i am going to be using my laser again all, uh, towards to the frigs as you can see you know i use this laser because to me it's just a lot more accurate than using the cannons the cannons i gotta fly in much closer and then it's just i miss sometimes so for me the laser is just more accurate now i'm not gonna tell you that i'm a 100 percent sharp shooter onto my lay uh not um to my cannons so that's why i use my laser so now i'm gonna fly into the cannons in here and um, while i'm flying i switch my weapon into the single target now um and i've also switched to laser and like i said when you're flying make sure as you're flying through the space and you're trying to reach your destination is that you are charging up your laser weapon so that when you get in range you just release it and attack the target and you are going to you know deal a significant blow now if you are not charging your laser as well you're not going to hit with a much uh significant damage so if you're only tapping it tapping it you're not doing well you need to hold it you need to charge it and then you need to release it that gives you the maximum uh maximum damage now as you can see i'm not getting closer in here because if i get close in here all of those cannons are going to target me and i'm not going to be able to survive that uh that area so as you can see there's a certain part in here i'm gonna get closer as you can see i'm kind of in range of the cannon sound 1.4 kilometer um the thing here that's keeping me alive is that the frigates i, I mentioned that you need to keep them alive because by keeping the frigates alive 
it allows them to be distracted those cannons are distracted because now they are targeting the forgets not you so now that i've eliminated that cannon i'm going to fly in and i'm going to charge my can uh, my laser and i am going to hit that next cannon as you can see i still have one forget alive in here and the cannon is actually targeting the forget so sometimes they miss they don't always you know hit it uh accurately now we have about a minute left in here what's my next play i'm using the cannons uh, sorry, I'm using a laser and I'm using my missiles in here. I'm trying to deplete everything I've got. I'm trying to go fast in your Swisher Cannon for rapid fire. Now I'm going to go to the next one. We have 50 seconds. Can I defeat this? Yes, I can because I am going to show it to you here. Use the laser right away. Uh, at this point, you can tank this damage in here. It's not going to be a significant amount of damage that's going to you know deal to you. I've uh, switched to my cannon for rapid fire. I'm going to try to limit it. I move closer made some mistakes in here i missed a little bit but move closer so that i can uh you know have a better vision or better angle to the target in here so we're gonna definitely finish this as you can see it we're having about like you know less than uh, maybe more than 10 seconds left in here so less than 20 seconds so there we go 15 seconds left i actually did much better in my previous week you're actually going to see it here in the video as well um so anyway good luck to you guys hopefully this video was actually helpful for your success